Come on, challenge me, Dak. I'm, I have your class setup, bro. Yeah, I get smoked on your class setup. Woo! See what I mean? Like, you just get used to it a little bit. Oh, my. This guy's class setup is elite. I am Trident, and today we're going to do a whole different challenge. I'm going to call it the copycat challenge. There's a mechanic in Call of Duty Modern Warfare that if you press triangle while your kill cam is open, it copies the enemy's class and lets you spawn up with the enemy's class. So basically this entire game, I am going to play with the enemy's class and not a single one of my classes. I'm going to die by the enemy, I'm going to watch the kill cam, press triangle, copy their class, spawn up with their class, their setup, their guns, everything of theirs, and then I'm going to play the game until I die again by another enemy, and then copy that enemy's class, and so on and so on. Um, so, without further ado, let's hop into the gameplay. Alrighty, so right off the rip, I'm going to try to just let somebody on the enemy team kill me right off the bat, just so I don't even use one of my guns to get a single kill. Hopefully this guy will just shoot me. There he goes, and it looks like I got a sniper right off the bat. So I press triangle and I spawn up with a car and an overkill ram. I have not used this ram gun yet. Um, the car I've used a couple times. Please don't kill me yet. Okay, he's dead. We're gonna try to pick the guy who killed me first, maybe? Um, there's a couple reasons why this challenge is a little difficult. And there's some, some challenges to it and why it's a challenge and not just like something to do for it, it is something to do for fun but it's also a challenge and a specter because you never know what kind of class the enemies are going to use the enemies could be really bad enemies they're not going to use that good of classes their class setups are going to be terrible they're going to use terrible guns maybe a 725 here and there overkill a lot as you can see here um a lot of enemies do use overkill but it also makes it so you have to change your play style a little bit you can't just play your normal play style running around with somebody else's gun uh as you can tell here oh my wow what are those shaky shots but as you can tell here i am a uh, I'm, I'm a submachine gun player and competitive so i like to push out lanes i like to get up in people's faces you know uh get get really close quarters kills and everything um but with using a overkill tar like this you know Th this class isn't too bad for my play style, but a lot of time when I get like an M4 or something, you know, it's it's a little harder. I got to play a completely different role, a completely different, you know, uh, play style. And I got to switch it up a little bit. I got to take my time. I got to pre-aim a little bit more. Ooh, saving my life. I got to pre-aim a little bit more. I got to play my life. I got to play slower and it changes up everything. I can't believe I just got a hit marker there. But it looks like I got a sniper now. Overkill, see what I mean? A lot of people like this overkill. A lot of people in pubs use these overkills. Um, which can be pretty nice. Uh, I There was one guy set up that I've, I've played a couple games with this. Uh, trying to do this challenge. Off of, you know, video and stuff. And uh, it can be a lot of fun. And they can have some really, really nice class setups. But, a lot of the time, these pub players, they just... They have very weird classes. Classes you've never used before. Guns you've never used before. Um... You know, just multiple different things that you've never used or a completely different play style from the play style you are. Uh, which is kind of cool and why it's a little bit of a challenge is you can't just play your game. You know, you have to adapt to the enemy. You have to adapt to how they're playing the game instead of just flying around the map like a submachine gun player like myself. I forgot to press triangle. That does happen sometimes. Um, I can't just kill myself because that doesn't matter. Uh, you can't just fly around the map like a submachine gun like myself where you just play your play style and everything. You have to get it. You have to play their play style because it's their class setup, you know? Or play like a little bit different. Can somebody kill me? Come on, come on. Thank you. Those were shaky shots, my guy. I hope your class setup's good. Um, he's got, okay, an AK overkill, uh, MP7. Wow, what a class setup. I never would have thought somebody would have played with this class setup. But it does make kind of, kind of sense. Um, you know, you got the long range, but you also got this up close to deal with. It's a, it's a decent class setup. The AK I'm not too much of a fan with. Um, it's a decent gun, but it's not too good. Not as good as the M4 or some other ARs. Hey, damn, I got that sniper again, this Dak guy. Dak guy, the overkill, uh, sniper. 
Probably my favorite class setup so far is this stack, guys. Uh, class setup. The overkill, MP5, and uh, sniper. I think that's probably my favorite class setup out of all of them. Um, there, there, oh, there's some times where you just get get a class setup that's just perfect for your play style. So it allows you to play the game the way that you're used to it. And it allows you to just fry. And throughout the game, you get used to the enemy's class setups. You get used to the recoil um, and how they, how you should play with their class and everything. Um, that's another reason why doing the challenge is a little bit of a challenge. Because you uh, you don't know the recoil. You don't know their their class setup because you're just randomly picking it up. Um, so you got to get used to their recoil very quickly. But throughout the uh, throughout the game, you usually get used to it uh, pretty decently. Um, pr pretty quickly, you know. It's, it does take some time, but you get used to it. And yeah, you, you just start trying. Start playing the game correctly. Come on, challenge me, Dak. I'm, I have your class setup, bro. Yeah, I get smoked on your class setup. Woo! See what I mean? Like, you just get used to it a little bit. Oh, my. This guy's class setup is elite. Oh, I forgot to press triangle again, damn it. Sometimes you just do, especially when I'm making this video, I've noticed. When I'm just playing pubs, it's I'm, I'm usually pretty good at remembering to press triangle. But I'm trying to do the live com as I'm doing this challenge. So it's a little bit difficult. Uh, this is something that usually pops up as a M4. You play a lot with M4s, because a lot of people use this gun. They, they really enjoy this M4 gun. Um, which makes sense because it's a really good gun. It's a really powerful gun. Ooh, I, I heard you. Okay, Dak. See, see, Dak, you're you're playing wrong with your class setup. Like he has the some machine gun to play fast, but he just still sits back. He's very, very boring, very campy. You know, I feel like he he should push up more. I feel like that that would help his class setup more. Only use the sniper when you really need it on like long range engagements. Come on, challenge it. There's another one up there, isn't there? Come on, challenge. Okay, they're not gonna challenge. I'm just gonna start pushing this guy up. That's the good thing about this guy's overkill class though, is you can just switch back and forth to this long range or this up close submachine gun. Uh, ooh, this is one of the newer guns. I haven't used that the Holger and he's got an RPG on it I have yet to use an RPG um, That that's another cool thing about this class or uh, doing this challenge is you just never know what you're gonna get you never know Never know what kind of class setup they're gonna have Back to this car and Ram Probably the second best class that I've gotten so far is This guy's class It has that little bit of both. That is really loud streaks, but it has that little bit of both. Long distance and close distance. Is that guy in church? Yes, it is. Killed him with his own class. That's another thing that's really, really enjoyable. It's, damn it, I forgot to do press triangle. What's really, really enjoyable is literally, like, killing the enemy with their own class setup. Like, smoking them with their own gun and their own, own setup of their guns and everything. It's... It's really fun. Come on, where's... Okay, there. I at least picked up his gun. Okay, he's sitting in a corner. With an AK. This is the overkill guy, yep. Let's see how this AK... AK has a lot of recoil, though, which I don't really like. A chopper gunner? How the fuck did this guy get a chopper gunner? Hold up. I'm gonna go out of the, uh out of it real quick just to blow this guy's chopper out of the sky because he should not have a chopper there it's gone now now we can go die get another class set up there perfect Again, I haven't used this gun yet. Even when I had it last time, it, I died too quick. I didn't get to use it. Um, see how this... Okay, there's a guy just chilling right there. Oh, this is the guy with the RPG, isn't it? Yeah. Ooh, that shoots super straight. 
Oh, let it kill him. Oh, yes, a rocket launcher. Let's go. He's got gas grenades on. Okay. Oh, this is the M4. Quick round magazine. That is really loud streaks. I apologize. Those streaks are super loud. Oh, he just killed him. I'm going to kill this guy off rotation. I don't know where. The, he's got to go back mid or something, right? He'll be swimming in the back, it looks like. See, this is this is the difference. Is like you gotta play completely different with somebody else's gun. The whole play style has changed. The way that you play the game is completely changed. Twenty-five kills so far. Eh, I'm doing eh. I gotta hold this hill because I'm trying to win the game, but I'm trying to get these kills. Push out and get. Ooh, there's a guy there. Uh, oh, I just saw. I thought I saw somebody top that window. See, this class setup's not bad. This is a. It's an M4, but it's a slightly running gun kind of M4. I'm able to be fast with it. Oh, I got C4 in my DAC. You suck, dude. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna take that out. Oh, I think that was gonna hit. Smoked by his own class. Oh, no. We're gonna screw that. Oh man. Oh, we got an MP7 though. This is a decent class. Decent, decent class setup. Hopefully our team can get, uh, get on the next hill. Oh man. This is gonna be a hard one. It's gonna be a hard one to win. Oh. I don't know if we're going to win this game. I was hoping to win win the game as well, but it's looking like the enemy team might be uh, might be taking this dub. Where'd this guy go? There he is. There's one there. Got to play a whole different game mode, like a whole different play style, which it, it's really in fun, really fun. I forgot to press triangle again. It's really fun to do. It's enjoyable. Um, sometimes it sucks, but it does until they kill me. All right, perfect. And we got this guy's class set up now. Another MP7. I haven't used this guy's class up yet, but the MP7, it's a good gun. We'll see how it, go how it does. Wow, that... <laughs> Woo! I don't know how I feel about his class setup. I'm really up on mad bullets and people. That's a sniper. I think that's stack. I'm just gonna watch this cross for my teammates. Oh no! Okay, good, good. Oh, they're gonna. We gotta contest that. I think that might be game right there. That's game right there. Not too good of a game. Not not too not too bad. Okay. Not too good. Not too bad. Uh, 39 kills. Um, this guy's class setup was probably the best class setup. Uh, the overkill, SMG sniper, best class setup in the game. Obviously, he had 35 kills, so um, he knows what he was doing. He was setting up a right class, correct class. Um, that's the difficulty of this this challenge is just having different class setups and using them against the players that already know their own class setup they have the intelligence of the recoil and how the game how they play the 
the um, map and everything on their own class setup. So it's a lot of fun. It's a good little challenge. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy uh, the challenge, you want to see more, hit that like button so I know that you guys want to see more. Uh, I might do a couple more of these and just see how you guys are feeling it out. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, follow me on Twitter and Twitch. Link in the description. And as always, guys, have a nice day, evening, or night, wherever you guys live in the world. Meanwhile.